What is up guys, this is Karan here. Welcome back again to Tech Karan YouTube channel. This is Kang OS and I'm using it on my Redmi Note 8. After hearing about this build, I thought this might be a very good kind of a custom room with very good kind of performance and a lot more things also with some customizations. But unfortunately, it's not like that. If you can check out my control center, my quick settings actually are a little bit of laggy. Not saying it's fully laggy room, but yes, it's laggy. You can see even swiping from here is a little bit of laggy here too, which is one of the main reasons behind that I am not going to use this build. And in this video, I'm going to shift you my honest opinions about this build. Is it good for daily use? Of course, it's not. But which other things you get here? Let's try to find out which other things you get here. Guys, we are talking about Kang OS, which is based on Android version 11, the latest Android version 11 build, which is available for Redmi Note 8 users. If you're a Redmi Note 8 user and want to install Android 11 based rooms, there are a lot of other custom rooms available. And this one is one of those, which has the maintainer equanimity, equanimity and we have the latest November security patch. This one is actually on a visual build with some a little bit of good kind of things also. Pixel launcher is available. It has Google Apps pre-installed. So kind of a really interesting also includes the Google Camera Go edition. Some things are really good. I'm not saying performance is bad, but it's of course not up to the mark. First of all, make sure about this quick settings. These are not looking good. The swiping down is not even good from swiping down. Swiping down from here is also not looking good. And you can see there are some lags here and there. I don't know. It's all about only for me or for everyone else. But yes, this is a little bit of laggy here. This is the main reason why I should not use this room at all because there are a lot of custom rooms available and nowadays where there's a lot of competition between custom rooms the this might be this should be a good kind of thing to use but is it this is not one so yes there are other rooms available which I'm gonna use right now moving on to some other things which you get here all the pixel apps as expected that it includes the google apps that's why it has and also includes the gcam go edition which is working fine of course and also we have the option of choosing the gcam main which you can use gcam 7.3 7.2 or whatever gcam version you want to try it out gcam modded versions are available too which includes tr cam and pixel cam fuse many gcams options are available which you can try out i have a video on that one make sure to check that Take a look at the safety net status. In my case, I am not install. I have not installed the magisk right now. You can see no magisk installed, but uh, without magisk, you can see safety net status is not passed. So, which means you need to root your device by installing magisk. And also you can try out magisk hide if it is still not passing a safety net status for you. Guys, talking about some customizations which you get here. Kangi's lab and themes which is the main thing about this customer which has some customization themes has the same kind of theme engine and I saw this theme engine maybe in Corvus OS which has the same kind of things we have the fonts customizations which includes a lot of custom uh, custom fonts which you can apply if you want to icon shape etc these are some customizations and themes if you get here the things which are working and which are not working as I previously told you the room is looking quite good and almost everything seems to be working here didn't write any major things but almost minor things are working fine flashlight auto rotate battery hotspot with alongside with the wi-fi everything seems to be working bluetooth is time using and it's everything seems to be normal and working in fine but the thing is about the performance if the performance is not up to the mark this might be the reason why i should not use this and of course i will recommend you if you want a good performance custom room based on android version 11 in my case right now, Pixel Experience and Octavi OS are one of those custom rooms which you can try out definitely. Kangi's Lab includes some customizations, status bar, quick settings, buttons, notification, lock screen, which you can definitely explore if you install this build. Network and internet connected devices, other things seems to be same here, talking about the battery backup. Battery backup seems to be normal here. I just reinstalled this build to check out this kind of thing, but it was again this. So that's why it's showing me only nine minutes of screen on time because of the reflashing. But other things seems to be same here. Battery backup was same too. I got approximately of six to seven hours of screen on time with approximately 65 or 66 percent of battery so you can easily get nine to ten hours of scene on time which is quite good and honestly satisfied with that but other things seems to be the thing which includes the performance issue for performance issues one of the main things for me 
This is all from today's video. I hope you like it. If you like it, don't forget to like and share this video. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe me. Thanks for watching and goodbye.